I'm Dr. Laura Larson. I'm the Medical Director of Infection Prevention at Tanner Medical Center, and I am an infectious diseases physician. So I enrolled in a clinical trial in September of this year to receive the COVID vaccine or placebo. I knew that research has been ongoing for mRNA vaccines for more than a decade. And after seeing so many patients succumb, become ill and die, I wanna do everything I could to protect myself from getting sick and to take any disease, keep from taking any disease to my family. So I received a shot and then I received a shot four weeks later. I find out in a week whether or not I actually received the vaccine versus placebo. If I did not receive the vaccine, I will immediately get the doses of the Moderna vaccine from my clinical trial site. I felt so strongly about being protected and trying to get back to some sense of normalcy for us. This has been a hard, hard year and I never really wanna to have to go through anything like this again. I think it's extremely important for people to know that I felt safe about getting it, that the safety data is really good, and the efficacy data is unreal. We haven't had a vaccine that has 95% efficacy in a long, long time. I get a lot of questions about why don't we have an HIV vaccine if we've had HIV for 40 years, or why don't we have a vaccine for cancer, and why don't we have a vaccine for a common cold? Those are very, very complex things. HIV mutates daily. A vaccine that you would make today wouldn't be effective tomorrow for that particular infection. There's hundreds of vaccines that are hundreds of uh, viruses that cause colds, and there's hundreds of cancers. It's, there's not simply going to be an answer for those diseases in our near future. COVID-19 is one disease, one virus, with one very special spike protein. That's what we've made this vaccine for, and we've been very fortunate to have this happen as quickly as it has in our lifetime. The science has really stepped up to the plate, and um, it's remarkable for me to have experienced this. For the people that are concerned about how this has happened so fast, we didn't rush the vaccine in the sense of, we normally do phase one trials and then we wait, we do a phase two trial. And that what we're doing in phase one is to establish the dose. In phase two, we establish the safety. And then the third trial is when you establish, did it work or not? So we actually rolled all of those phases out quickly. Uh, normally something that we would wait and do over years happen in months. And we also enrolled a ton of people in phase three. In my clinical trial for the Moderna vaccine, um, 30,000 people were studied. That's a massive number of people in a phase three trial. And that's why we got efficacy results within months. So it's, it's not rushed in the sense of being unsafe, but it was rushed in the sense of, this is the way we can do this in 2020. So I just wanted to make sure you had that information. I think it's very important for you to get vaccinated. Um, unless you have a contraindication so we can go back to more normal life in 2021.